don't over eat at night last food must be before sunset then you can take any number of hours to sleep but don't eat after the sun sets the jain system is very healthy in your sleeping room don't have any electronic gadget on aap to pasevi bhavet arogyam treat everyone as your near and dear ones sleep well and how much should one sleep i don't know you may want to sleep for 10 hours i may want to sleep for 4 hours it's individualized but on an average about 6 to 7 hours 8 hours is good if you but don't sleep more than 9 hours because your your life span comes down your muscles degenerate you're not made to sleep and don't sleep when the sun is up don't sleep when the sun is up your sleep rhythm starts only when the sun goes down our ancestors used to sleep when the sun goes down because they had no light and they wake up before the sun comes up because the light comes before the sun comes up when the birds start chirping that's the time the sun has already risen somewhere and but what happens today in bombay there is no light at night at all there's no night at 24 hours there light probably night has more light than day time and these artificial lights are very bad in your sleeping room don't have any electronic gadget on the electromagnetic energy is bad for you you don't have even the switch on of a television which is switched from your you know bed no switch it off and don't keep a mobile phone for for charging at night no don't have any switch on don't want dirty electricity effect on you do you know if you go to a laboratory with so many computers there and so much of connections there so many cell phones give your blood 200 blood sugar you go to maidan stay for about 4 hours then call the man there to take your blood it is 120 that is the effect of these electromagnetic gadgets on you so don't sleep with that number 3 don't sleep with any light coming to your bed because be pitch dark the darker it is the sleeper comfortable is asleep a lot of people say snoring is bad but i think everyone snores people who don't snore don't know because only their wives know they snore and i was i was one of my students one day told me in the class sir why do they why do you think they call it a sound sleep his argument was very interesting he says unless you make sound you are not very very sleep deep sleep very good idea no? very good idea anyway so that's the, that's the one thing about sleeping last thing is don't overeat at night last food must be before sunset then you can take any number of hours to sleep don't eat after the sun sets the jain system is very healthy jain system is very healthy theek hai na see she knows she knows and you eat like a king in the morning your breakfast must be eat like a commoner at lunch time eat like a pauper at night so small and smaller frequent meals would be very nice if you are a diabetic or a hypertensive small small feeds i say six feeds 8:30 10:30 12:30 3:30 6:30 9:30 3 three of them must be small meals three of them must be fruit eat as much fruit and vegetables you like if i can request you be a vegetarian because there are 600 6000 articles saying that cooked meat is one of the very important cause of cancer but that you don't get to read because the cancer industry suppresses it and why why do you want to make your stomach a, burial ground for animals just eat vegetarian food which is which is good for you not that vegetables don't have life they also have life but the cycle is different they don't have the kind of emotions that we have their consciousness is something different you read jc bose plant consciousness and human consciousness is something different you will be surprised in the west people don't even believe that plants have consciousness i was giving a lecture in the royal college in london where i mentioned about this consciousness in a talking a very senior fellow after wrote a letter to me saying that what were you talking through your hat plants cannot can't have consciousness so i sent him all the data then he says my god i never realized that i am such an ignoramus till i read your papers but let me tell you all the others who are listening were also ignoramuses like <laughs> that's, that's a very interesting thing now last thing is work samiksha kari says ayurveda work very hard but work must be one you love don't do any work which you hate you will die faster love your work you will live long 
and don't think simply sitting is bad sitting is very bad sitting alone can kill about 60% of people just doing nothing sitting man is not meant for sitting what you can do sitting do it standing what you can do standing do it walking and the best exercise for the day is walking this is the only one that reduces 80% of your risk for death premature death walking has been now found to be the one risk factor remover for 80% of the precautious deaths not running not jogging not playing the kind of sports that our people play on the television it is killing the harder the more exercise you make more damage to the heart occurs and so last but not the least love everyone you will live forever and so beautifully put by ayurveda nitya hita mita aahara sevi that is understood samikshakari which means work hard data be a giver not a taker because when you give you become god what's the difference between god and man god gives and gives and gives and forgives man gets and gets and gets and forgets so if you just become instead of a getter giver you become then what says samaha treat everyone as equal satyapara don't cheat don't do all that what subramanya swami is fighting against don't do that last kshamavan you may say i won't hurt anybody somebody might hurt you you forgive him he doesn't know poor man what is that i forgive him that's the most important thing forgiveness and even the western philosophy you see radiard kipling wrote in the poem if if you can fill the unforgiving minute with 60 seconds worth of distance run you shall be a man my son and more the earth shall belong to you what a beautiful thing and he says more you if if you can walk with the kings but still keep your common touch if you can mix with the crowd but still keep your virtue so what a beautiful thing so all these things are good health lastly it says aaptopa sevi bhavet arogyam treat everyone as your near and dear ones you will be healthy till you die thank you very much